What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. It's new release day. Streeting today is 2019 Upper Deck SB Authentic Hockey. This is a 16 box master case break. Pick your teams number two on our website. Uh, this filled before number one. Uh, we had a handful of teams left in number one, so we put them in a little filler uh, pack break. And we're down to 21. We should be able to get that done today. Um, but we're skipping over to number two. Again, we have plenty of cases to go around. So this is pick your team number two, guys. And we're also giving away an SP Authentic box if you buy three or more teams. So buy three teams, you get one entry into that giveaway. You buy six teams, you get two entries, nine teams, three entries, etc., etc. So we'll alphabetize by customer name to see who has entries into this giveaway and see how many customers are in that. And we'll do that at the end of the break. But let's just start ripping. It's been a while since we had a new, new uh, release for hockey since like credentials and I actually don't even think I broke much credentials did a lot of OPG Platinum that's my favorite SP Authentic another fan favorite uh Comic Hunter I, don't, I have no idea man I didn't create those I just think maybe cause be a little too pricey for some teams so if you buy the if you buy the same team in all four picker teams you're pretty much buying into a case so I think it ends up being the same price Or we didn't get much. That could be the other thing. Come on, Case, are you stuck? Hey, we're stuck. Yeah, so whatever, however many boxes are in a case, what is it, 12? So I assume Pikachu teams 1, 2, and 3 are from the same. 4, 5, 6. Or. Etc. Et something like that. So I don't know why we did it that way, but as long as you just get them in the in the pick your teams, you should be okay. Yeah. Someone will take that risk and get them in like only one of them. Or, you know, if we have to, we put them in a team run and number block or giveaway, et cetera, et cetera. But yeah, we may, maybe we didn't get much. That's probably why, too. I think Core Kings is not the f most expensive product, but it's obviously with this draft class, there are some teams that are pretty pricey. So but yeah, if you were lucky enough to get them in all four or however many picker teams, then you got them in all the same case. So you're good. Alrighty, guys. So again. Chase Future Watch autographs. I know people are going to say, wow, why are they numbered out of 999? But, I mean, it's just the way it is. And there's also a new product coming out soon, too. It's called Stature. Which, if you really think about it, kind of looks like 5 Star. Which is going to be pretty cool. Um, but, yeah, we figured, why not get all 16 boxes done in the same case, Curtis? Just get it all out. Instead of half cases. Yeah, how about that, Globebook? Did anybody buy it at thirty thousand? I doubt it. Someone would be crazy to buy it at thirty thousand. I honestly think that it should have been like ten k, since like the box would probably go for five. Usually, first of the lines double the price, but thirty thousand—that's that's insane. Oh, it starts tomorrow. And ain't no one gonna buy that. Yeah, no, not for you, Comic Country. Yeah, I mean, sorry if we don't have it. Obviously, if you shop elsewhere, I'm sure you can get your needs there. But well, honestly, SP Authentic packs are usually easy to rip. It's just these ones are really rough this year. Like I can't even get my groove in because I have to make sure not to damage the cards. This is not a good start to SPA. Although the cards always look fire. Yeah, I, I, I'd be okay with it selling for like 10, 12,000, but not 30. I don't know. I used to, I can fly through SPA, Curtis, trust me. But I don't like these packs. These packs are not helping. It's too rough. These packs in like a couple years are going to be really hard to rip. They're actually just going to just fall apart, I think.
Alright, we've got a redemption right off the bat. Future Watch autographs. Uh, Rudolph Balsers. I have to look that up. I totally forgot where he plays. I haven't seen hockey or heard of hockey in so long. Alexander Radulov. Sign of the times. Uh, actually, you know what? Balsers is auto centers, isn't it? If I remember correctly now. some uh, young guns as well. Adam Johnson. And wow, we got a high gloss. Man, I right off the bat. These are tough to hit. And it's for my kings. Look at that. A high gloss. Who has the kings in this one? Edward. There you go. These are super rare to get. And they have the FX Spectrum. Are they are they still doing the the first like hundred get a numbered set? Is that what it is still? And Zach Rowinski sign of the times. I was also hearing on some forums that this SPA is delivering more than just two autographs. That you're getting like up to three or four in every box. So that's a good thing. Oh, they still have the bounty? What's the bounty about? You still get like the numbered gold set? Is uh... Is what's his name for the Devils the best one still? I remember that first year they did that, or in a while, that 16-17 year? Yeah, yeah. I remember the first year they did that in 16-17 with, with Austin Matthews. There was three customers that shopped with us when I did Hockey Land. Um, back in the day, uh, that actually got three out of the first 100. It's crazy. Yeah, yeah, I figured it was auto. That's what I remember now. Digging this pack, man. They're just, they're just so rough. Gotta make it easier on us, man. When it's, when it's a, uh, it's a heavy base product like this. I just want to fly through these packs. Hoping of all 16 you see in front of me, Gabe. Oh, we had a Zach Rowinski, Radulov. Belser's Redemption. And then the High Gloss. Oh, is that you? Oh, yeah, that is you, Hunter. We're done. Hey, you got a high gloss. I mean, not that I'm interested, though, to be honest. I only really collect certain Kings players. I don't really go all crazy. 
which is Kopi, Kempe, and next year will be Gabriel Velarde. Oh, let's go this way just because I feel like the other guys might have been all in the first box. Adam Warner. Future Watch, Spectrum, Coolman, and then this is a level one. Drew Doughty, FX Spectrum. Spectrum cards look really good this year, actually. Ooh, we got a patch autograph coming up already. Very nice. Adam Brooks. Usually one per inner. And Giovanni Smith, to 999 Future Watch for the Red Wings. Steve. And we got Caden Fulcher. Auto patch, 41 out of 100. It's a Future Watch patch autograph for the Detroit Red Wings. Going to Steve. Very nice. All right, next box, guys. Caden, Future Watch, Level 2, Elias Patterson, here's a Future Watch, 
trying to. And we got Belchvin, future watch for the San Jose Sharks, going to Michael. And we got sign of the time rookies to 99, Carson Coltman. For the Bruins, going to Edward as well. And Young Guns of Igor. Yeah, it's just two autographs, but I think I've been, I heard a lot of people today saying that uh, there's up to like four sometimes. Like our first box had three. You're still guaranteed like one future watch or patch auto in every case. So I think we hit one in the first inner, so now we gotta do the second one. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Trevor Moore, Spectrum Level 1, Future Watch. And you got John Tavares, Spectrum. Leaves going to Tony. Adam Johnson, Young Gun. For the Ducks, future watch. I think this is an update. Mark Jones. Or no, sorry, maybe it's just a retro update or something. Max Jones. Ducks. One of my Gucci. And Victor Olofsson. To 999. That'll be one of the Sabres.
Our next box. Alright, Carey Price, SB Essential, Adam Warner, Young Guns. Matthew Barzell, exclusives to 100. Hey, Ramon, what's going on? Sean's over there, Ramon's over here. Tobias Jornfront, Future Watch Level 1. Svechnikov. And Kirby Dodge, man. There's a lot of redemptions in this, bro. It's going to go to the Chicago Blackhawks. Adam Brooks. And Patrick with that one. Kirby Dodge. Jack Hughes, authentic winners. And Mackenzie for the Blues to 999. Uh, Charismatic, no veteran common ship. No vets. So all the inserts and uh, I think they still call these pinks. Oh, the stuff on the... So just inserts and the pinks and stuff. Yeah, it's a lot nice. It's pretty nice this year. Maybe a few boxes. Oh yeah, these packs are so rough to rip this year. It's crazy. He actually, do you have a Give us more pennies, please. Yes. Yeah, so right. Standard. Yeah, just regular. Right regular. Yeah, right away. I'm my fingers. Okay, slice open a few more of those. Yeah, yeah. But I forget. There's not really that many cards, so it's actually not that bad. It's not like OPC. Oh okay. Add 
Actually, can you, can you do the whole sticker? Yeah. Seems seems so excessive. Yeah, I know. How to protect that SP authentic? Yeah. You can see me, right? Okay. Yeah, yeah, you're good. So Joe will be ripping some boxes as well. Yeah, new product. It looks like five star. Yeah, it kind of looks cool. I'll, I'll, tell you, I'll take the five star treatment. All right. And that stature. I just love that these, these, all these companies like just come up with the same thing, but like, let's just change the name. <laughs> Big star. I know, they're like too rough. I, I'm telling you, like in a couple of years when they start like drying out or something, they're gonna be, they're gonna fall apart. They feel like those kind of packs. Yeah. Yeah. And usually they're easy to rip. That's why I was like so excited, I'm gonna fly through this, but I have to just make sure the cards are not damage or anything. Each box contains one future wave watch rule Anyone cool so far? Um, yeah, we, well, a couple of them have been redemptions that are good players. Okay. But yeah, they look more loaded this year too. I feel like there's more than just two autographs now. I feel like you get three almost. Almost. What's the uh, What's the story on NHL coming back? I think so they I already they approved it. I just don't remember what the day it was. Yeah, I think they approved it. The 2014. That's the last I heard. And yeah, it's like a. Just like, and have like the, tw yeah, the, the 2014, 2014 little playoff kind of like a little and tournament. Figuring out hub cities. Yeah. So they're taking, yeah, they're figuring out whether it's going to be like either a city in Canada or a city here in LA or Florida, whatever they decide. I know basketball is like official now. Yeah, they're, they're, they're doing Orlando. Orlando plan is happening, right? Yeah. 12 more regular season games and then. Yeah, I don't know if I would want to see NBA do that, like do like a tournament. They just need to figure out the seedings. Is everyone gonna ever gonna play? I know Damon Lillard was just like, I'm not really. In the yeah, he's like, if we're not in the playoffs, I'm not playing. We're like, well, that's why I think they had to do it this way and give everybody a shot. So yeah, so he right. So that way everybody's like, all right, because it's true. It's like, why am I gonna play for if like I'm right. not even gonna play and make it playoffs? Yeah, looking at the game start in August. I know that I heard that the NHL is just gonna run right through no training camp really. They're like, just gonna, they're just going to dive right in. Yeah, they're going to dive right into the season. Which they kind of usually do, if you think about it. They're usually playing until, like, the middle of June. They pretty much get just all of July off, and then all of a sudden they're back in again in August. Start training. So it's, like, it's really not that bad of a difference. And since a lot of these teams haven't played since, like, April, it's kind of like them just having a normal off season. But the other teams, though, obviously they're going to be playing like crazy. But you have had, like, two months off, so your body should be rested. This is going to mess up all the seasons for next year, too. Yeah. Are they going to start a shorten season? I mean, you could do that, too. Cody Glass, that's nice. To 9.99, Vegas. Going to David. Hey, what's up, David? I realize we got the Knights. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean, you just think about it, you've had a normal season, really. A normal off-season, being off these last two months, so. There shouldn't really be no... No problem. I think, if anything, what they're going to do is, if they jump right into the season, they may just have, like, no back-to-back -back for a while, you know? And kind of spread out the games. And maybe extend the season like, maybe extend the season like, you know, an extra couple weeks just so that way you, you have, two, I, think, I think I heard them say they want to have two like weekends or two weeks of just no, of just like bye weeks, put it that way, per team. So that can be another thing too.
everybody should be up and ready to go, so. Alright, nice spot, guys. Authentic moments. Roman Yossi. And a future watch autograph of Igor. For the Rangers. And a redemption of future watch rookie autographs of Taro. That's going to go to the Detroit Red Wings. And again, a lot of redemptions, guys, so far. I guess these guys couldn't sign. Uh, Nick, I did contenders number four. If you're in number three and it's sold out, it should be after this. I think the only other break that sold out after this was just Revolution Basketball. So, it should be within the next hour or so. Those breaks are all pretty quick, so. Yeah, I know, which kind of sucks, but, I mean, it is what it is, right? All right, so Detroit getting that one, Steve. Good break for Detroit so far. Yeah, what's up, Sean? What's going on, man? JC? Young gun. Tom Shaw, Future Watch. Patrick Kane, FX Spectrum. Igor, Level 2. Preston Krispy Kreme, I don't know if you've seen it over there. Jacob Truba, sign of the times. Rangers. Going to wave. And Trevor Moore to 999. I haven't gotten any inscriptions yet. Yeah, well, I wanted to come out a little earlier to try to get like some of these hockey ones out of the way, Sean, because it'll kill like an hour. But it filled like maybe 20 minutes before he got here, so at least that way more uh, more time for other breaks. But I think I think a couple of the breaks, like Cellos that have sold out and stuff, I don't think that came today. So I think that's why Nick also put like Wednesday, Thursday, so. And then a lot of the a lot of the um, actual breaks on the website, a lot of pre-orders for like Friday. I think the only other big break is probably like a, the baseball mixer, but that should just be fun anyway. So, how did the other mixer go? This one yesterday. Was it good? Uh, the four case mixer. Yeah. It was awesome actually. Yeah. Yeah. I did a separate recap video. It's worth a it's worth a look. It's got a Zion autograph. Oh, nice. So that was nice. From Prism? Uh, yeah. Yeah, the hobby, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Prism hobby. 
No silver John Morant, no silver Zions, but yeah, yeah. But that autograph, but a lot of base. Yeah. Oh, that's good then. That's so, still, yeah, yeah, that's still a helps. Of base and a few base for the Grizzlies. Uh, Luka Doncic, Trey Young, dual autograph out of the 1819 Immaculate. Oh, we pull one of those again? Yeah. Yeah, those are cool. Atlanta won the randomizer. Ah, uh -huh. that's tough. Who had Atlanta? Chance Motes. Yeah. Wow, that was a little heater. He uh, he hit that purple disco yeah. the other day. Um, he was trying to buy it off of Dallas. Oh, and really? Really? Dallas. Dallas Maverick said, "You know what? I'm a little bit of a gambler. I just want to let the randomizer roll." Oh man, it's brutal. It was tough, yeah. Um, who had who had like the Pelicans? I forget who ended up with the Pelicans. Dang man, we're both gamblers. Yeah, because you can just be like, yeah, I'll sell it, but then, you know, you might have won the randomizer. Right, and You're exactly. just like, I don't even have to exactly. sell it. But, oh, well, I guess that's what it is. Hey, I, I appreciated that uh, that gamble, though. Yeah, I know, right? You're like, I like to live dangerously. Yeah, I mean, I was like... Because <laughs> one day you're going to be on the correct side of that randomizer. Exactly. Yeah. awesome, yeah. Go for the Kings. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. level one. FX. Future Watch Spectrum. I have no idea, Wade. How, I mean, we have like 20, 20 orders to go through or something. Not too much. I went through all of them pretty much, but I think. Uh, yeah, we're still at 21. I should still go off today. I don't think it's not. But number three might fill before number one. That's the thing. <laughs> Looks like number three is down to one left, so. Rosen. This is an update. I think this is last year's Future Watcher. Actually, no, this is 17, 18, I think. Yeah, there you go. Update there for the Leafs. Photographer. Brady Keeper, number to 100. Florida Panthers, uh, it's going to Michael. SP Authentic is one of the, like, the flagship product for Upper Deck, right? Yeah. I mean, it's funny because, like, you would think that, like, an autograph out of 999 is not going to sell well. But it's like, they sell really good. Because this is like an old brand. Yeah, yeah. Forever, yeah. Yeah, they do like golf with it. They yeah. do basketball. And... So it's cool. It's really like the sign of the times are the ones that are really nice. You get like all the eight way autos and stuff.
Ooh. Makar. Future watch. To $9.99. Who has the Avalanche? Jeremy. With the abs at number two. There you go. You spoke a little too soon, Wade. <laughs> And Noah Dobson to nine ninety nine for the Islanders. Islanders. Brady Kachuk. All right, charismatic. I'll try that. We'll try it with you. Say it again right now when I bring over the next box. Aside from the hits, what are you what are you setting aside? I'm just doing all the veteran bits. So it's kind of oh, like this. Oh, it's like a series two pattern. Okay. So it's pretty. It's kind of simple. It's not that hard. Um. But like sleeving is like. Yeah, just the autographs. Feature, autographs. And then like watch? the. Spectrum. Yeah, the autographs for sure, and then the spectrum cards. Yeah, the ones that are like this. Okay, gotcha. And okay. then young so, guns. Oh, and the, right. Yeah, just those three things, pretty much. I. Yeah, I think I'll come back and I'll help you with number three before I go oh, on. Oh, this is two? Yeah, well, number one, did, number one we put it in a pack break. So, oh, and then you skipped, skipped it? Yeah, you skipped, skipped it? it skipped it? Went right to two? Yeah, someone bought the Canucks like in two and three or some of the bigger teams and then kind of just rolled from there. So, that's what the people want. Yeah. You that Dobson? His blinders? No problem, man. Right? And then this is like, there's one shade, you'll notice it, but it's okay, I'll go through the base again. But it's like a pink. You'll notice it like on the back too. That's the only other one that I like, use <laughs> They call it like a pink, even though it doesn't look pink. Ooh, nice, we got our first uh, inscriptions. There you go, Caden. Two out of nine ninety nine. So the first, I think fifty, right? The first fifty that they number, they're, in, I remember that. they're inscribed of their of their debut. So it kind of makes it more valuable. So he made his debut just this past season, I think. Uh, Edward, there you I go. I feel like they should do that more. Like just yeah, it's fun, right? Manufacturer, I think that's a lot of fun. Los Torino. Be like, yeah, that's the first fifty. We'll have like a special inscription. Yeah, Even if it's just something as simple as like the debut date or something. No, yeah, it's like true. I really like it. I made a note. Yeah, the debut one sometimes go for a lot. Jake Wallman, Young Gun. See the curvy today is at nine o'clock <laughs> instead of like six the last couple oh, days. Yeah. Santa Monica says it's six. Oh, uh, does that have yeah. six? Oh. Some cities are a little bit earlier, but I don't know. I had no issues last night. Yeah, me neither. Although there's a lot of cops. A lot of cops. Them. Yeah, they drove by for like, sure. Like, hi, <laughs> hi guys. Show my essential, yeah, my essential like, yeah. uh, paper. My essential employee. Yeah, we have more cases, so once we get through these first three, which we will today, I'm sure Nick will post up more. So we have we have a couple more cases. I think we have enough maybe for like another four figure teams maybe. To nine ninety nine for the auto Senators future watch. And sign of the times. Dirk Graham. Probably in about 30, 40 minutes, Jalen. The only other break that sold out before I started this was Revolution, so Joe will do that first. And then he'll go through some orders to see who sold out contenders, and then I'm sure contenders will be the third break. So, it'll be up, it'll be coming up soon.
Yaka. Um, I don't remember, Jalen, to be honest. I just remember that last box we did was like a crazy box. It had like two cracked dice, although they were sticker players, but it had two cracked dice, a DK mech have redemption for like a variation. And then it had like a one on one printing plate autograph. It was crazy. Like for a box that, you know. A lot of color, put it that way. But yeah, the video should be uploaded. But yeah, it's, it's, I don't remember if there was any bills, to be honest. Wow, this is, this is the product we're going to get so many blanks in. Oh my god. Uh, restock our blank collection. I know. Um, Adam, I don't, I'm going to see what you're talking about. Oh, that's a good question. I have no idea. Nick just titled it Prism Basketball. So... That's a good question. I have no idea if they're blaster or not. I'm assuming they're blaster like you are, just because they're ten boxes. But we can confirm on next soon. Because uh, unless that's hobby, that's a great price probably. For which, for which rate? For these ones. Adam thinking that's probably blaster. I was like, oh, technically. Oh, probably yeah. Say. Twenty box breaks. Yeah, ten ten. Does it so. say in in the description? I looked at it right now. I don't think it does. Oh, it doesn't say. I don't think so. I mean, maybe it's hobby. Who knows? <laughs> but yeah, it's probably blaster. So I'm assuming. If it's ten and ten, yeah, because I think there's twenty in a blaster case. All right, guys. I should be doing this right now in about like five ten minutes, and then Joe come in. Ooh, David Ayers. Wow, they did to make his young gun. That's awesome. Do you remember that guy that came in for the Canes? They actually made his young gun. Oh, nice. <laughs> I wonder what these are gonna go for. Yeah, Bama, I don't know if we have Mosaic here today. The cello packs. That's why Nick put in the description uh, Tuesday or Thursday, uh, Wednesday, Thursday. So it's going to be one or the other. If they didn't come in today, it'll go tomorrow. Fifty bucks for this guy? That's awesome. Man. I don't even think I would sell for fifty dollars if I was a young gun. <laughs> I just like to hold this young gun in there. And Bill Ranford. What a great goalie coach. There you go. Oilers going to Kathy. Brady Keeper. Taylor Hall. Last three boxes are over here, guys. All right, you guys, good luck. See if we can get a, at least one of the uh, Hughes brothers. Oh, yeah, I said I brought it for us. So oh, 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 yeah. Get, get one while you can, you know. Yeah, just definitely. Gotta little, save it. A little coffee and a... Uh, 
Krispy Kreme donuts today, guys. Wow. It's a good day. Barrett Hayton. The 9.99. I was actually waiting in line, and then I was like realizing the ordering in the mobile app was much quicker. Clem Colston to 9.99. Benstrom. Did your baby song? Jacob. Mark Stone. Tristan Jari, Anthony Mantha, Future Watch inscription. Hainola to nine ninety nine for the Jets. Going to Steve. And another David Ayers Young Gun. What a great break for the Kings. If these are selling for fifty bucks, you got you got you got a hundred dollars right here. Rossman's Dalin as a little filler. Yeah, that's the Future Watch inscription, their debut. CD. Philip Zadina. Very nice. There you go. Another one for Detroit. And this is Detroit. Yeah, Colby. I think we're all excited for Core Kings. I probably won't be breaking it. I'm not here on Friday. And we'll see if there's some still on Sunday. But, yeah, Core Kings is always a fun product. I think Joe will have a lot of fun with that. Yeah, I got confused right there for a second. Sometimes they do have the initials of the player, but that one wasn't. Heishkinen, Roop, Future Icons, Chili Champion, Sign of the Times, William Carlson. Have you guys been keeping up as well, too, with the Economy David RPA? I think it's still at 50,000. I think two weeks left, three weeks left. It's going to be very interesting. You're the highest bidder for that right now? Damn, it's Landers. Crazy. Yeah, Curtis, uh, there was a lot of looting around us and protesting, so we wanted to be safe, so we took a lot of our inventory and stuck it out in a very safe location. So we wiped off the website and just kept it really tiny, and we're going to update some more today. To 399 Future Watch, Joey Decor. Wait. 
Yeah, we're just trying to be safe for cautious. I, I was gonna put up a little thing, but we'll put it all back up again soon. If not today, tomorrow. I think once all this stuff calms down, uh, should be back to normal. But um, we'll see how today goes. I might be just helping Joe do some pack stacking or something today. We'll see how Instagram is today. That too, Curtis. I cleaned it out yesterday too. Alrighty guys, so there you go. So here you go. Let's quickly show you a lot of these hits that came out. Again, this is PYT number two. Number three, I think, sold out or is about to sell out, so we might skip over number one. So stay tuned, guys, but I think all three will sell out today. Good deal, though, for um, PYT number one. You can win a almost $200 team for as low as 20 bucks, which is not a bad deal, guys. But this, uh, this future watch this year looks very, very sharp. I do like it a lot. Um, and hopefully in the next case we get some, some bigger patch autographs. But pretty solid stuff, though. Detroit, Phillips Adina, Bill Ranford. Another David Ayers. Kale. Patch autograph. And we did get a high gloss though, which is pretty cool for my kings right there. So there you go guys. Now let's give away some, uh, well not some money actually. Uh, let's give away SPA box. Let's do it guys. So again, you got how to buy three or more teams. Alright, three or more teams. Uh, it's not technically sold out, man. If you look right next to it, that allure break is going to hold the last six teams. So, Curtis, you had one spot. David only had one. Edward, you had three. So, you'll get one entry. Jeff with one. Jeremy with one. Kathy with one. Matt Bugler with one. Michael with two. Michael Gallucci. One, two, three. So, you get one entry. It's three teams? Yeah, three teams. Wow. Mixing it up, huh? I know, right? Patrick, Steve, one, two, three, four, you five, read those six. Item Ooh. Gotta read those item descriptions. I know. And Wade, Tony, the one. Wade, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, could have gave you one more, but you get three of them at least, though. Wait, so three gets you one. Oh six. wait, sorry. Six gets one, two, you two. Six gets you two. That's right. Yeah. Wait, you'll get one, two, three. Yeah, you'll get two entries. No worries. So there you go. Small list, guys. Yeah, Steve had six spots, right? One, two, three, five, six. All right, good luck, guys. Customer number one gets a free box of SPA after two and a five, seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. After seven times, there you go, Wade. Box of SPA coming your way. I know you had some big teams in here as well. No Canucks coming out, so I think that kind of makes up for it. There you go, guys. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Uh, coming up next, I believe, is Revolution, but Joe will do his intro and all that and then do some more breaks for you guys. Appreciate it.